welcome back to my channel and of course welcome to another episode of Review Wednesdays. But today's video is quite different because I decided to combine it with the 500 pesos makeup challenge. I know, I know, you've seen a lot of 500 pesos makeup challenge and don't worry, napanood ko din, yun napanood mo. That's why what I did was um, a list down all the products they've used from St. Yoko's videos to Candy Love Arts and a lot more. So, nilista ko yung mga products na ginamit nila and then when I went to the department store, I tried not to buy any of the products they've already used. And believe me guys, it was so difficult to buy products or to come up with a whole makeup look using products for just 500 pesos. Because the big balakid was that I couldn't buy the 100 peso kit that has eyeshadow and I think there was also a mascara or eyeliner or something and lipstick in one kit because I'm pretty sure you've seen videos na meron na ng ganung kit. So what I did was um, I rely on the possibility of dual products. Dual products meaning one product that could be used in two different ways. I'm pretty sure you understand that. Okay, so let me give you a rundown of the products that I bought. For the foundation, I bought two kinds, so you have two options. First one is the Idol Classic uh, Powder Foundation, and the cost is 130 pesos. So dual powder to to sabi ni ate, meaning pwede mo siyang gawitin ng wet and or dry. The next option, this is not part of the equation, just another option, is the Nichido... I think this is the Nichido... Pa uh, no. Nichido Foundation Stick in the shade Beige and this is 150 pesos. Now, I also have this eyebrow kit from Fashion 21. It's 150 pesos but sabi ni ate, this could be an eyebrow kit or this could be an eyeshadow. And I was like, oh, perfect. And then, I got the Idol Classic Mascara. This is 50 pesos and it's just a small mascara. Nothing too special. For the lips, I got this uh, Jordana Matte Lipstick. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I was so excited to use this one, so I tear off the plastic and use it right away, and then I forgot the price, but I'm pretty sure it ranges from 100 to 150, but I'm pretty sure it's not gonna reach 150, probably 120. So this is the first option. Another option is the Everblend Advanced Lip and Cheek Stain. Yep. So here's what I'm planning to do. I'm gonna do a 500 pesos makeup look, but at the same time, I'm going to give you a first impression or review of the products that I bought. So first thing I'm gonna do is apply foundation and um, since I have two options for the foundation and two options for the lips, I'm uh, gonna half half. Over here is gonna be the powder foundation and over here is gonna be the stick foundation. So, so let's go with the powder first. So I used a sponge. That is white. First thing I noticed yung sponge niya, parang hindi ganun kabongga. I mean, performance wise. Siguro ko ibang sponge na babasa mo, baka mas effective. Uh, so, something bad happened, you guys. Napunta ka ng CR para pasayin ulit yung sponge kasi parang natayo na siya. And then this happened. So, meaning to say, marupok ang sponge nito. Okay, so I am done putting the uh, powder foundation at the left side of my face. Um, it mattified my face, but it didn't give me uh, enough coverage. And then, medyo nag-move pa yung product niya pag binadaanan ko ulit ng sponge. Now, moving on to another option you can use. The Nichido Foundation Stick. Nagamit ko na dati eh, when I was younger. So, the way I apply it, ganito lang. The dot dot lang all over my face, and then I'm gonna spread it using my fingers. Honestly, guys, I can tell that I like the stick better than the uh, powder foundation. It gives me a more natural finish and uh, more coverage, I suppose. 
But of course, you have you still have to set it with a uh, powder. Para magstick talaga siya sa skin mo. Plus, your foundation stick has a tendency to be oily by the end of the day, so you really have to set it with a powder. Now let us move on to the eyebrows, and uh, yeah, I'm using the Fashion 21. Uh, Duo eyebrow powder. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wet the brush and then get the brown powder. So guys, if you're planning to use uh, the Fashion 21 eyebrow kit, make sure that your brush nyo ay wet. Because if not, na parang nakapatong lang yung powder sa eyebrows nyo. Other side. I think I got the wrong color. Dapat lighter pa. Maraya pa ibang colors nito eh, different color combination. But I got this because I was aiming for the black color because I'm planning to use it as an eyeliner. So done with the brows. <laughs> Intense brows. Let us move on to the eyeshadow. Taking again the Fashion 21 um, eyebrow powder. I'm going to get the brown color over here. So I'm just gonna apply it all over my lid. Honestly, guys, not bad. Not bad at all. Pwede nga siyang eyeshadows. <laughs> so after the brown powder, I am going to take the black one over here. Using the same brush na ginamit ko sa eyebrows ko. Babasain ko lang siya. And then I'm gonna dip it at the black powder. I'm gonna apply it as close as possible sa eyelash ko. Oh! Pwede siyang eyeliner, guys. Oh my god, you guys. I can't believe it. See that? This product is not just two in one, it's three in one. Eyebrows, eyeshadows, eyeliner. Like, seriously. Of course, you have to use a better brush than what I'm using, pero alam mo, mina maximize ko lang yung tools na kasama dun sa products. Other side. Okay, so done with the eyeliner. Uh, I'm gonna take the eyeshadow brush again and then uh, dip it lightly at the black powder and then apply it at the upper crease just to give my eyes more dimension. I'm gonna apply the same thing at my bottom waterline. Just blending my eyeshadow pa taas. What I'm gonna do is apply mascara, and again, I am using the Idol Classic Mascara. It's just a small mascara, and it's only 50 pesos. But let's see the performance. Ooh. So, yung bristles niya medyo thick, but the bad side is yung product naka clump dun sa bristles. Parang lahat ng product na puta sa eyes mo. Oh. So, something bad happened. That's super, super clump yung product dun sa bristles. Pag, uh, dumilat ka after, pag dumilat ka talaga after using the mascara, some of the products transferred sa eyelids ko. Yeah, I have some over here, but it's okay. Taking the eyebrow kit again, I'm gonna dip my uh, pinky finger dun sa brown color and just contour my nails. Oh, that's also good for contouring, huh? Now let's move on to the lips and I have two options for you. You can either use the Jordana Matte Lipstick or the Everblana Lip and Cheek. Tint. I was able to use this uh, a few days ago and um, okay siya sa cheeks mo. It's gonna stay on your cheeks. It's gonna look natural. But this is bad for your lips. Kasi ang pangit ng lasa niya. I swear. Uh, I swear. Ang pangit ng lasa niya. Ang pangit pangit. Ang pangit ng lasa niya. I'm just gonna use the Jordana Matte Lipstick instead. So I'm just gonna apply it uh, imperfectly on my lips. Then using my clean pinky finger, I'm gonna spread the product all over my lips. And here's the trick that I'm gonna do, guys. It's not it's not something new, but if you're not sensitive, you can use the lipstick as your blush, as a cream blush. I still have products on my pinky finger, and I'm just gonna put it on my cheeks and just spread it evenly. I have a flush of color on my cheeks already. Oh my god, you guys. I have a red uh, spot on this side. Wala yan kanina, pero ngayon meron na. Ito yung side na ginamitan ko ng Idol Classic Powder. So I am guessing my skin hates this one. Which is okay because I hate this one as well. <laughs> pero yung side na merong Nichido Foundation Stick is still good. And nag-apply yung uh, blush ko more evenly than some my uh, so this side. Look 
at that. It's dry, it's patchy. I don't recommend this, guys. So there you go. That completes my 500 pesos makeup. Do you like it? I hope you like it because I kind of like it. Honestly, guys, I was not expecting that I was gonna come up with this kind of look. Cause it's a little bit of products. Got. Again, if you're not sensitive, you can use the lipstick as your blush. Or you can go ahead and buy a lip and chic tint. Okay, now I'm gonna give you a recap of the products that I use. For foundation, I use the Idol Classic Powder Foundation and the Nichido Foundation Stay Between the two, I'm gonna give this one a 100% yes compared to this one. This one sucks so bad. It is so bad. But I think it's okay to use as a setting powder. No more, no less. Now guys, please give this tiny product a slow clap, standing ovation clap, because I was not expecting I was able to use this at a maximum level. I mean, eyebrows, eyeshadow, and liner in one product, and it is just, what, 100, uh, how much were you again? 130? 150. Thank you. Thank you for saving me. For the lips, I gave you two options, Lip or Chick Teens. Again, this is good for your cheeks, but bad for your lips because it tastes so bad. So I used the Jordana Matte Lipsticks. This is in the shade Chocolate and uh, I love it actually. It's very, very cheap. It's comparable to the Wet n Wild Lipsticks, but this is cheaper. Highly, 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 highly recommend it. You can buy this on Instagram or you can buy it I saw some of this at the SM department store, SM North Etsa, as well as the Landmark. Yeah, at the Landmark. For the mascara, I use the Ida Plastic Mascara. For emergency purposes, this is good, but for a daily basis, I don't recommend this, guys, because it's 50 pesos and it works okay, but the quality is not, not that good. So I suggest you go save a few bucks and buy yourself a Maybelline mascara. So that's it, that's all I use. And yep, yeah, I hope you like my 500 peso makeup look and the mini review I gave on the products that I use. So it's time for me to say goodbye. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video, like my other videos, talk to me on all my social media accounts. And yep, yeah, that's basically it. I will see you in my next video. Arigatou gozaimasu! I'm curious on what this color looks like if I apply it like 100%. Wow. So intense. I love it. I love it. Jordana Matte Lipsticks. I'm gonna come and get all of you.